show you how to make a cracker into a fudgy treat. Up next on the Trailer Park Cooking Show. Jolene Sugar Baker, yeah, Jolene Sugar Baker. She's bringing the trailer park lifestyle to the world. Come inside, don't be shy, you gotta meet this girl. She's got gossip and food and lots of news. And dropping in on neighbors is what she do. Lots of cheap fashion is the passion at the park. Passion at the park, passion at the park. She's Jolene Sugar Baker, yeah, Jolene Sugar Baker. wanted to do that for so long but I just did it and well anyway it's Jolene Sugarbaker and welcome to the Trailer Park Test Kitchen and welcome to another edition of Cooking with Jolene the Trailer Park Cooking Show where I teach you how to live on a budget and do it the Trailer Park way. Well I'm so excited I've got something unusual to show to you because I had to come in unusual today inside the Trailer Park Test Kitchen because I'm going to show you how to take boring old saltine crackers and make a great fudge candy out of them with a homemade caramel and a chocolate topping that you put on top of them. It's a great candy that you can take to a buffet or make great gifts out of them. It's called glorified crackers. Yes, that's right. You're going to take saltine crackers and make a great dessert out of them today on the Trailer Park Cooking Show. I'll be right back. Welcome back. Making the glorified crackers is really simple. And up on your stovetop, you'll need a saucepan, and you'll need one cup of brown sugar, which I've got right here. So I'm gonna dump that right on into the saucepan, and one cup of butter. So I've got that ready, and just dumping that right on in there. You're gonna bring this up to a boil, and then you're gonna boil it for about two minutes. So let me get this started, and I'll check back with you in just a moment. Meanwhile, in a 9 by 13 baking pan, I took the saltine crackers and laid them out in strips and put them in the bottom of the pan. I'm going to set this aside and keep working with my mixture up here on the stove top. Now that the mixture has melted down, we've brought it up to a boil and we need to make it boil for about two minutes. Our mixture has boiled for about two minutes. Now we're going to pour it over the saltines which are resting in the 9 by 13 pan. So just go ahead and pour that right on over the layer of saltines, just like that. There we go. And you can kind of swish it around just like that to cover everything. I preheated the oven to 350 degrees and we're going to bake these for about 8 minutes. So go ahead and pop them in now. Okay, our crackers have been baking in the oven with that mixture up on top. And I've got about a cup of chocolate chips that we're just going to spread out on top just like that. And they're going to melt in just a bit. We'll just push them out just like that. And when they start to melt, spread them out like frosting. So give them just a minute to warm up and just spread them out. By spreading the chocolate chips out, it kind of mixes with the other mixture. Now add about a handful of your favorite nuts. And you can add a little bit more, whatever you like. And we're going to set this aside to cool. Then we're going to cut them into squares. And I'm just going to add a little bit of more nuts here. There we go, and it kind of looks like fudge or brownies. Um, it's really pretty, and we're just going to set this aside and let this cool off. And there we have it, my glorified crackers. And it's a nice little candy treat, and they sure do make little great gifts in a little container. You can make a whole bunch and put them in a container, put a pretty ribbon on it, and give it to your best friend. But we put nuts up on top. You could use any kind of nuts that you'd like. But these have cooled off, and we cut them into squares, and I just can't wait to try this one. Mmm! 
taste that caramel. Very homemade taste. Very good. Tastes like vanilla and chocolate and nuts and the cracker has turned into just something totally different inside. And wow, that caramel really has a pop. I hope you get a chance to make my glorified crackers. And if you do, send me pictures at JoleneSugarBaker at gmail.com. Don't forget to follow the trailer park on Twitter. I'm Jolene's trailer there. Add me as a friend on Facebook. I'm Jolene Sugar Baker there. And of course, add me on Google Plus. I'm there too. Don't forget to subscribe because there's some more cooking shows right around the corner. And don't forget to share this with your friends because they can make these too. Wow, that's really good. I can't wait to eat a whole bunch. I'll see y'all back real soon. I love y'all. Bye-bye. Slap on all your blue eye shadow. Watch out for that big tornado. Get all filled with Bye. pride in the double wide. Visit my store at trailerparkstore.com.